everybody, welcome back to Vanessa Moon Tarot. This will be for the lovely sign of Sagittarius. Happy belated birthday to those who have already celebrated their birthday and happy birthday to those who haven't. I want to thank you all for continuing to visit my page. Click the like button, the subscribe button, share this video with your friends, let them know what's happening over here. And also feel free to visit my sponsor uh, you can get $1.99 for 10 minutes with any Keen advisor, so that's for Keen.com. All you would have to do is visit my promo code, which is via link, so it would be trykeen.com slash Vanessa Moon, all right? I did put that link in the description box below, so feel free to try it. Also, I'm also on Keen as well, so let me know if you want a reading. I can pop on there for you guys. Uh, there's other ways to find me as well. I'm so glad you're here. Let's begin. What I'm going to do is get four to five messages for you all and then clarify. I'm going to be using this Mystical Moments Tarot and I'm going to use the Witch's Tarot, okay? All right, let's go. Let's go. Sagittarius, I hope you're having a good month. What, um, when I was pre-shuffling for y'all, the Hierophant popped out. So this is a time for y'all to have faith in what you want to come true. That's also a heavy soulmate card. All right, first card up. Three of Wands. Okay, so you can expect something. You can expect to receive something, okay? Or something that you've been waiting for or patiently working towards, strategically working towards and putting a lot of passion and effort into it. It is coming in and you're going to see it happening, okay? Oh, I like this card. Um, so this person has kind of like built this huge mountain of of accomplishments. And now they're at the top and they're like, okay, well, um, where's the rest? Okay, well, the rest usually comes on, you know, the universe is timing, divine timing, right? You can only get so far by yourself, okay? So trust. Um, look at that, King of Cups, okay? Some of y'all could be a water sign involved, specifically a Pisces doesn't have to be it just could be a very loving person it could be a requited love oh judgment making a final decision okay so something you've been waiting for it's time to um you're feeling the pressure to to call it okay um some of y'all could be waiting on a legal judgment as well that will be coming in you can expect to be able to make this judgment eight of pentacles definitely going in your favor for some money Okay? Some of y'all new job as well. That's great. Some of you even put a lot of effort towards that's what I'm getting. In your everyday life, it's been it's been causing you to have to do a routine, um, to make a schedule, to put into it every day, and and you're gonna see the results. It's gonna start moving in a on what I say, King of Pentacles. That's gonna move in an extremely positive direction. Okay? So now you have an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, specifically a Virgo. You have the Judgment card, sign of Scorpio. Also Pluto. So the thing about this is there's something that's you're finally going to get in control of. That's what I'm getting. You're finally going to get in control. You're finally going to know um, after what whatever hard work you put in, you're going to finally have the, the money to invest in that thing that it took you a while to build. You also have a wealthy person here wealthy person could be involved a boss or father figure knight of cups okay sagittarius so two extra cards came out one it was supposed to be one now you get the star card scorpio also got the star card okay uh so you may have knight of cups so you have a you have an offer some of y'all have something to do with music playing music creative arts um this is also a serenade somebody's being serenaded here sung i'm mean, just saying um, and the star card, you have sign of Aquarius here. So now you have water sign, an earth sign, Scorpio, uh, Aquarius, energy, ten of cups. Woo, Saggy, you keep getting this ten of cups. Ten of cups is like the best card, in, one of the best cards in the deck. Um, just how, look at how peaceful and serene those, those two are. So this is about like, just something is growing. Something is growing or something has grown. A ten is still a completion of a cycle. So now you're but the end of this cycle brings fulfillment, emotional fulfillment, contentment. Um the the uh complete satiety, completion, okay? Like so complete and total happiness, the dream, the 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 future, the future visions, the family, the relationship, okay? Wow. I'm going to put that there. 
So what do I see here? I see there's something you've been waiting on. A final decision could be revolve, involving um, a corporation, could be involving marriage. Could be involved, something that you're going to be committed, committed to long term. You're not in control. Uh, this person, someone could be offering you something that you'll love coming in fast quick in a hurry and just it's going to be overflowing this opportunity it's something that's destined there's a lot of there's a need again to have a lot of hope and have a lot of faith and there's gonna be this thing is going to heal all the, the troubles and the strife you went through and it's going to bring complete and total completion and happiness wow and under that is asa asa Wan. so a creative endeavor that brings you complete and total joy and um i'm getting stability and look ten of ten of pentacles I didn't even want to pull that many, but it's just too good, baby. Um, so now you have now you have legacy and emotional fulfillment. So this is a relationship here. Some of y'all, it's marriage. Wow. And some of y'all, it's family. Some of y'all could be extending your family, starting a family. I'm here, extension of family. Someone could have a child here as well. Three, three and one becomes four. Something like that. Very nice. Be starting a family. Some of you are anticipating um, a judgment regarding money, regarding something. Some of y'all are straight up getting um, um, that job in that creative field that you've always wanted, that you've always strived for, that you didn't think was possible or attainable. You're getting that that offer from that. I'm hearing from that big. Get, some of y'all getting that record deal. It's like something like that. Okay. All right, why is the Three of Wands here? I'm going to clarify this Three of Wands for you. So whatever you're expecting to come in, let's see what it is. Three of Wands for Sagittarius. There's also a lump sum of money here, too, in a judgment. The Tower card. So something comes out. Something fell apart. Oh, okay. Wow, look at this. So you have the Tower. To clarify the Three of Wands, you have the Queen of Cups, the Tower, and the Strength card. Okay? Under the deck, two of cups. So, let's go through this real quick. All right, so something you've been holding back from, keeping your emotions open, and it just busts wide open. Something, someone you love unconditionally that you were holding back from because you're waiting to see what would happen. You're waiting. You're waiting to see. Like, this is this is like you're trying to hold back your excitement or your, sad, your sadness. You're trying to tame yourself, and now you feel like you can't wait anymore. Because you need a decision. A decision. Ooh. Or somebody comes in shocking you and tells you they love you out of nowhere and that they love you unconditionally. It's a judgment card. Could be a Virgo. You have Virgo and Scorpio and Leo here. You can watch all those signs too. You don't have to just, it doesn't have to be one of them involved. But those stories should also line up with your story. Um, now you have the Wheel of Fortune. That's Jupiterian energy. That would be your energy as well. So the judgment is clarified by the Seven of Swords. The moon, the hermit. Somebody's been keeping a secret for a long time and they haven't been honest and they haven't been saying exactly how they feel. They've been afraid and they had to really get some perspective and reflect. They could have ghosted you. They could have never told you why. They could have kept something was a secret for a long time or it just was hidden from you for a long time. You're just finally going to get called. You call judgment on it to the universe and the universe is going to bring you an answer. Okay? It's, it's time. Wheel of Fortune. What's the King of Pentacles doing here? I'm going to clarify the King of Pentacles now, okay? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, someone ready to invest. Uh, Chariots, Knight of Wands, Ten of Pentacles. That Ten of Pentacles keeps showing up for you. Look, you have it here twice. That's that's um, long-term wealth, a lot, lumps, that's a whole lot of money, generational wealth, stability, consistency, family, multi-generations so somebody was a family with somebody and they must have kept it a secret for a while and here they come barreling in with the speed of lightning sagittarius could be you as well it could be the male the masculine um somebody maybe is running or leaving a relationship a long-term relationship and now ready to invest with you this is also somebody getting really excited and moving up in a job and getting moving up the corporate ladder or owning their own um, um building owning their own uh business that turns into something that employs multiple people okay that's very nice you could be working at a place like that you could be take somebody's somebody could be traveling towards you from far away traveling to your home 
let's see what else we got here. Under that is Ace of Swords. So now you have Ace of Swords, Ace of Wands. So, so you're going to find out the truth. This is a truthful new beginning. This is also the sword that cut. So something, someone might be having to get cut out of someone else's life so they could enter your life or you enter theirs or whatever. Someone's getting a clean slate though, okay? There is a victory. It is a victory because it's, you have two cards of victory here. Somebody feels victorious to be with you, Sagittarius. Let's clarify the Knight of Cups. Or you feel it's victorious to be with someone. Like it's a victory. You've been waiting for this. It's been a secret for a long time. You've also been waiting for this opportunity. It's now time to go to the next level. It's time to move up in your career, in your lifestyle. And you, maybe you want to travel. Some of y'all want to get, a, you know, you're the sign of traveling. Um, let's see, Knight of Cups. Clarify the Knight of Cups. I clarified the Knight of Cups with the Knight of Cups, by the way. So, to clarify the Knight of Cups, we have the Knight of Cups, the Hangman, and the Six of Coin. Under the deck, we have the Six of Wands. So, we do have a victory. Again, now we have three cards of winning. Winning after a long, long, arduous battle, a competition, uh, so to speak. Maybe there were more than one person involved in the situation. Somebody was giving to someone who kept them stuck, and now they're ready to offer something, okay? Somebody's seeing something differently, and now they're ready to move forward and balance something out, the Knight of Cups, because they're in, deeply in love, okay? Or deeply in love with this, I want to say, career. It's a lot of career energy here, okay? But it's also family and love. You're having both. You're having Ten of Cups and Ten of Coins. So that means you're getting career, career and family and love, okay? Oof, that's nice. Look, three of wands wanted to pop out again. That was flipped over. So you can expect your ships to come in. You're going to be able to see whatever that project is that you launch. You're going to start seeing the results. All right. It's going to come rolling in little by little so it can maintain stability. The kind of thing that comes and doesn't leave. Ten of cups. Somebody could be somebody could want your help as well, too, Sagittarius, just so you know. You're going to have to there or they're going to whatever they give you, they're expecting to receive in return the same amount of effort. What is it? The, the uh, star card. That was the next one. That one I, OK, that was the five of cups that fell out. So somebody feels regretful. OK, the star card clarified by the high uh, the hierophant. The five of coin. There's that same type of energy. Lonely, abandoned. The financial material change and the four of wands could be a Virgo Gemini because now you have that and you have Pisces here as well. Um, okay, so at this point, we have like every sign, right? Um, Taurus, uh, so right here, Taurus. So to clarify the star card, right? So, um, this could all be culminating around February as we have the star card here very March. So right here we have somebody very devoted and they feel like they have to have faith in order to make this change in order to ready to be stable and and to be ready for this celebration, this relationship or this event, this up level, okay? This is a level up. A level up energy, okay? This is something that someone always wanted. It's destined. It's destined to happen, okay? This could be an institution right here, a banking institution as well. You're receiving some type of wish fulfillment from a banking institution. It could be a loan, okay? You could go from rags to riches with this kind of energy. But something is changing. No more lonely time. Some of you are going to stop going to end. Never be lonely again because you're going to be married, okay? You just have to have faith and walk through the window when it's ready. When the universe presents, when the universe presents you with this opportunity, this ace of wands, as a fresh start, you're encouraged to take it because it will lead to ten cups. It will lead to you being very happy and very stable. The magician, you manifested this. Very beautiful, Sagittarius. So what I'm seeing here is something you've been waiting for. You're shocked. You're shocked because somebody can no longer hold back tame themselves. They think you're very beautiful, very unconditionally loving. They miss you. They they want to get in control of this. And they feel very sexy as well, very beautiful. You're their dream. They feel like it's time. They feel called. Like the no time like the present. I have to do this now. I've kept my feelings hidden for too long. Okay, I've kept my feelings hidden for too long. I lied to myself. I was afraid. I'm no longer afraid. I've grown up. I've matured. I've spent some time with myself and I've learned now what I really want. Okay, it's going to shock your whole world because this person is so stable. This person is so sure. They're so committed and they're so ready to invest. 
Maybe before they were flighty and they ran out on you. Maybe got into a relationship with someone else. Or they weren't ready for a long-term, stable, committed relationship. And now they're ready to invest. They also want to travel with you. They want to start a family. They want to join your family. This person is in love with you. You also have, they want to go on a getaway, a trip. Like I said, they're seeing things differently. They want to balance out the situation and they want to give as much as they receive because they're super in love with you and they want to tell you. They might even want to sing to you. Then you have financial and material changes regarding um, never being alone again. Also, I, like I said, loans from the bank, getting some type of judgment regarding money that will help you to grow some type of... Um, also, somebody you can be hired at an institution. Something that will uh, take you to the next level up in your career. And you will not have to worry about money again. Then you have the star card wish fulfillment. And you have some type of huge event or milestone coming towards you. Could even be a wedding. Ace of Wands, a creative endeavor. That everything you manifested is going to give you long-term happiness, stability. Stability, 10 coins. And happily ever after. This is like a freaking dream read. Okay, and it's destiny because the star is there. So you got the king of cups and the queen of cups here. Wow. Okay, two different two different decks, but still a true pair. So those are people who are completely in love with one another. Some of y'all could be starting a family business as well. So let's see what's going on with your um let's get an oracle card for you, Sagittarius, and see what journey your soul is on. That's your soul journey. Where you are on your soul journey. Let's see. So you have denial. Ooh, they want you to get out of denial. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with insight and awareness. Also, that have faith. Every, everything you manifested, you can expect it to come in. Have faith, okay? Use that Sagittarius optimism. No use. Listen, if it don't pan out, at least, you, at least you're optimistic enough to not miss the freaking cue when it do happen, right? Because your head won't down. Your head was up. Balance. That's, your, that's what your sign is all about. I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and I do so without judgment. Okay? Use your better judgment here. Learn from the past. One more. Oh, okay, two more. Every time I say one more, two come out for y'all. Grief. Okay? I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. I believe that. Right there how it says. And perseverance. Persevere. Have faith, guys. I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. And under the deck, you have love. Yes! Did I tell you you have love? So your perseverance, is your hard work is paying off. That's like the first thing I said to you. And then you have love. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. What I say about that optimism? What I say about that optimism? You such saggy optimism. Come on now. You know you're the, you know you're the best. All right? Love ya. Peace. This video is sponsored by Keen. Everyone deserves a psychic reading. Psychic readings can provide the breakthrough that you never knew you needed. Keen Advisors are available 24-7. There's always someone online. Keen provides access to vetted psychics and spiritual advisors who give guidance and insight on life's challenges, clarity and love, relationships, career, and more. As a new Keen customer, you can try your first 10 minutes for only $1.99. Just use the URL trykeen.com slash Vanessa Moon.